A Del Valley family is trying to cope with the loss of a mother and her two children. Three members of the Becerra family were killed Monday in a car accident in eastern Travis County. Another member of their family, 13-year-old Christian Torres, is in critical condition at Dell Children's Medical Center. KXAN's Katina McHenry spoke with the family and has their story today. Katina. Good evening, Robert. The Becerra family was headed home yesterday afternoon when they were hit by 44-year-old Kevin Sparkman, who ran that stop sign. Now the victim's father and husband, Francisco Becerra, was sitting also in the same traffic, and he would later learn of the tragedy as he was heading home, sitting in traffic. Now, Francisco Becerra has spent most of his day today on the phone and in meetings trying to make funeral arrangements for his family. Now his 11-year-old daughter Jacqueline Bassetta was killed along with their 9-year-old son Francisco Bassetta, the 13-year-old son Christian Torres who just celebrated his birthday this past Sunday is still in critical condition at the Dell Children's Medical Center. Now today at the family home, the Bassetto family home, Family members gather to show support. They are here from Dallas, they're here from Houston, and also Mexico to show support for their family. It's hard for them to put into words exactly what they're feeling today, but one question still remains is why Kevin Sparkman ran that stop sign. Sí, sí, pues. Me mató lo que más quería. He does have, I mean, he does have because, I mean, he took what they... Quiero mató. He's saying that he killed them, so... I mean, he took the most valuable things that he had in life with him. So, I mean, he is very upset and angry and something that was careless that it could have been prevented. Now, Sparkman has not been charged yet pending DPS's investigation. He could be charged anywhere with the least of his charges being disregarding a stop sign to the most severe critical, criminally negligent homicide. But as of now, he has not been charged. Now, the two children that were killed yesterday attended Hornsby Dunlop Elementary School in Dell Valley. A letter was sent home to parents today letting them know what happened and also to send condolences to the family. There is a family fund that's set up if you'd like to make a donation at Wells Fargo Bank. It is listed under the account name of Maria Trinidad Razo. You're welcome to make a donation in that account. Now, funeral arrangements are still being uh, planned for the family. For now, we're live in Eastern Travis County, Katina McHenry, KXAN, Austin News.